and I'm a bad boy Cause I don't even miss her I'm a bad boy For breaking her heart Peg. I'm out doing some, oh, damn it, I knew I should have sped, hate this fucking light. I'm out doing some motor vlog errands, um, I got a few shout outs, um, and I'm gonna do a little intro video for uh, Zach Goes, and for that I'm gonna need the Honda. Nice. How much of my life is wasted at stoplights? God. Well, I don't know if you guys noticed, but we cracked 500 in like fucking two days or something. I don't know what's happening. And everyone seems to be uh, doing like a giveaway at 500. And I know I missed it, but we should do some sort of giveaway, shouldn't we? I don't know what, like, you guys want a sticker? What do you want? Oh, I know what we're doing. Yep, yep, yep. All right, guys. Since we broke 500 subs, I believe it is appropriate to start a Teespring campaign. Do you want merchandise? I'll give you merchandise. If you guys aren't familiar with Teespring, basically what you do is I design a t-shirt, start a campaign for, I'm probably gonna do it for like a week. And during the campaign, uh, you purchase your and order your t-shirt. And at the end of that week, they start printing the t-shirts and stuff. And you should receive, you should start receiving your t-shirts two weeks after my campaign ends. So if I set a week long campaign, you buy a shirt during that, like in the first day of the campaign, you'll be getting your shirt three weeks from then. Okay, so I know it's a long time, but I bought one from Accidental Broadcast, and they are good quality shirts. Um, I'm going to set the price as low as I can. I think the average price for uh, the one that I'm going to make is about 12 to $15 range. I'm gonna do uh, the best I can to make it look sick, but keep the price real low. So that link will be in here. Uh, here's a picture of the shirt I'm making. I'll put a little link to the Teespringy campaign-y thingamajigs down there. This is the first, uh, first time I've ever done that. So if you guys want a t-shirt, that's ready to get them. I just want to warn you, it'll be a while before you get them, but just know it's like good handmade quality shit, all right? So, oh, before I get to my house, I'm going to do one now and then another one on the Honda and then blah, 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 Honda. So, first shout out goes to Annie Two Wheels 85 who, I think he's a new vlogger. I've been watching all his steps. And uh, he was the first one, and the only one so far, to uh, finish my scavenger hunt. Remember, the deadline is the end of this month, okay? So stop slacking and get finding. Anyways, yeah, let's see, any two wheels, a five, here's a link to his channel. He's got a pretty cool series, well, I like the startup series, going on where he uh, checks out historical places around his area, and he just checked out the sweet-ass fort. Now, I'm totally into, like, ruins and forts and stuff, as he knows. Oh, birds. I will destroy you. Yeah, you better fly. You gonna stop? Yeah, you're gonna stop. Let's do a jump. Gas is off. Let my brother Joyride on the ZX9. Ah, fuck it. 
Oops, my damn boxers and shit. There we go. All right, the other, uh, the other shout out I wanted to give out goes to uh, Gibby Moto Vlogs. Here's his link. He gave me a nice little, little shout out in his one of his videos talking about me and Ibn. So this one's for him. Go check him out. What are you doing? <laughs> Fucking dildo. <laughs> Cuz fuck them, that's why. <laughs> oh shit. Uh oh. Uh oh. It's overheating. Oh yeah, it's going into the... I know what it's doing. I gotta cool her down. I forgot to put my fan on. Yeah, baby Jesus. Well, thanks for joining me today, you guys. Uh, make sure you go check those two guys out. Uh, Any Two Wheels 85. And give me more vlogs. Hello. Some more good news. I'm uh, going to loan my old drift to Tony versus the world. I'm gonna get that sucker up vlogging. If it's the last thing I do, I'm practically forcing him to take my camera. He lives pretty close to me, so I should be able to get it to him pretty soon. And he said he's working on tire issues. What? I've never seen this gate open. I have to take it. I've never been in here. <gasps> cool. There is one. I do have spam cards. Hmm. Oh. Damn. Yeah. There's another one. It's an R1. Got him. R1 is sexy. Look at it being a Yamaha Honda. I wonder if anyone's ever built a Yamaha Honda. Ding! Looks like he's got a GoPro. There you go, little buddy. Let's be friends. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I got a little carried away. <laughs> oh, God. Well, later, pack. I'm not gonna warn you before you see them. <laughs> yes, I used a steak knife and cut my ear open. There's like some swelling in there, and I'm 